Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how you can downgrade your iPad 1 to iOS 3 or 2. Um, so mine is currently uh, freshly restored to iOS 5.1.1. I don't know if you can see that. Um, so yeah, let's go downgrade this iPad. So normally I will record from the display itself. But now um, I truly want to see, um, at least you, to see this iPad go um, without any kata from the video itself. Um, so yeah, you will lose all your data, all your email, yeah, you know. Um, so what you need, the files will be down in the description below. Um, what you will need is iDevice Restore. Uh, the Geekrate IPSW, actually it's custom patched without the Geekrate logo. Um, so what you wanted to do is hold Shift and FN and press the um, right mouse uh, of your, uh, well your mouse actually, um, within the pop-up. That's it, it's going to open the CMD. From. So you want to um, open up your um, your iDevice uh, folder. You want to hit the FN Shift, right mouse, and you can see here open a comment window here. You want to um, type in i the comments will be down in the description below. iDevice restore. Dash E, dash E, uh, and now your IPSW name. I've named the mine one, as you can probably see right there. One. Um, so we need. Alright, um, one dot IPSW. And now we'll drag the window up. No, not like that. Up and this iPad, like such a place that it's going to be good. Right. So, of course, you want to connect your device, and I'm going to speed this up because it's taking not a while, I believe, because it's tax red, but yeah, who knows? Who cares actually? So, just for the purpose, I'm going to use it. Oh, by the way, you need downgraded iTunes to work with Red now because you needed to tether boot it, but who cares? Uh, so, add device restore and the IPSW name and hit enter. And because you see, it's entering recovery. I want to show you the whole process. Fit it right such um, a placement. All right, and if it's showing this, um, what you have to do, of course, is put your device in day view mode. When I hold power and the home button for 10 seconds, when it's shut off, wait four seconds and release the power button. But keep holding the home button. And it's going to uh, iTunes is going to cry that your uh, device is in recovery. Um, but uh, you wanna, if this has happened to you, you wanna just press the up button on your keyboard, and then the comment will reappear. And when I hit enter again, you can see exploding with Limerick. If it's going to reboot, just redo the process. But if it's going to um, OK, uh, then it's going to re restore. As you can see, sending E back, and you, if it's a white background, it's going to succeed. And as you can see, 3 dart 2. Um, right there. Alright. So let's. I'm going to speed this up. It's not taking uh, a while, but, uh, 
It's not taking that long, I mean. Alright, and as you can see, the process has been completed. Um, what you wanted to do is hold the home and power button at the same time and put it again in day view mode. Hold the uh, power button, or, or the, sorry, the home button for again 5 to 10 seconds. And if you heard a bleep, let's go. All right, back to the PC and boot up Ratch now. Hit run. Nobody cares. Hit extras. IPSW needy. Uh, 3.2.2 uh, IPSW. Link will, will be also down in the description below. Um, so mine is in libraries. And then in the download section, let's do it from here. You can see the 3.2.2.pw. So 3.2.2, hit OK, hit uh, Recovery Fix. It's doing that shit. Uploading first aid, white background. Put it. This blown a kernel rebooting done, and as you can see, if you want to jailbreak, um, I had this issue before uh, with the tether downgrade, it's going to give you an error and waiting, 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 waiting. And you need to redo the process, and every shit is going to fail, and blah 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 blah. So, you want to redo the uh, thing. Right, and it's back in day view mode in a moment. Right, there we go. Run it back in your PC. Back, back, uh, extra select IPSW, the 3.2.2 IPSW, and you want to hit just boot. And you want to open up iTunes to uh, actually just activate. Uh, or you can, of course, use the Ryu tools. The Lime Rain exploit failed, um, so it's hanging on waiting for reboots. You wanna reapply the DFU mode uh, status. As you can see, exploit failed. Alright, back. Again, hit select IPSW. And, it's, and if it's going to refill, 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 just. Um, Reopen the program and it's guaranteed success. Um, as you can see, it's already done. Just booting, and you can see the uh, pineapple logo. So, in a moment, we will be on 3.2. As you can see, let's open up iTunes, as you can see the old Apple logo by the way. Let it load and it's accessing the iTunes store. It's activating probably and there you go. Welcome 3.2. You have an OS which you can't absolutely do nothing. Alright, um, now you have an OS which you can do nothing. It's so minimal. I looked at this and why the fuck have I this OS? I mean, sorry for my language, but man, it's this is outdated. I mean, sure, the Wi Fi works.
but it's so bad even I believe that's that is supported but um, better percentage think it's usage the uh, structures um, where did it sounds does it even have the Dutch language international language Dutch what <laughs> such a minimal language it's it's what you get, alright? And I remember it's going to respring and after setting the language. It's, it's really weird, actually. About, you can see 3.2. Wi Fi is successfully connected. Bluetooth, no. Slots. The home corner button. Which maybe in this. No. Why don't we plug? Oh no, it has actually a dark mode? No fucking way. I I know um, the iOS 3.1.3 has it, but I've tried to jailbreak before, but you know. Um, so it's absolutely not recommended to um, downgrade to this OS. Um, it's absolutely ugly, actually. Um, sorry if you can't agree on that, but maybe it's just the white on black. Um, sorry, so you had actually zoom. What the fuck? iPod, you. <laughs> oh no, I actually forgot it's still the iPod. But I hate that you can't. That you must have used the home button. It sucks, actually. Alright, let's jailbreak this bad boy. And it's tethered, so it isn't going to be untethered. Um, Alright, there it goes. Not in recovery. Um, minus. All right. Two hertz now. Hit back. Select and again. Reselect the three dot two dot true IPSW. Hit OK. Hit back. Jailbreak. It's patching the data. And it's it's the city and it's going to exploit. Again, if it fails, just redo the whole process. It's it's probably going to fail, but who cares? You can just redo the thing and it's going to succeed. So now, after, re after applying the recovery fix, it's going to wait and not giving you the um, spring error because the recovery shit is going to do stuff. So back on rats now, let's do its thing. Um, back on rats now, you have when it back. Select up is W uh, again 3.2.2 hit OK and just boot. And let it hang for a few seconds. So it's more still moving applications. I will speed oh no. Never mind. It's already installed in the Joe breaking and so on. Alright, let's reapply the day few mode. I mean, I tried Spirit Jailbreak, but even that failed, for me at least. Alright, just waiting for the iPad. I hope it's going to succeed. Yes! For the first time, Pino 6 pound logo. Alright, you can remove the cable. And you have succeeded in downgrading your device. Please leave a like in the description for my video and please subscribe. I'm getting uh, the. I hope to get on the moment a thousand subscribers. But. So. Um, you want to hit slide to unlock. Actually, in Dutch, is actually just. Unlock, not slide to unlock. It sucks. 
but you have the brood be the only thing I think it's beautiful the iOS 3.2 um I mean it's the wallpaper is such a beautiful thing right here. Slide to unlock, open obsidia, it's probably the only thing that works. <laughs> Not even minimal landscape mode. Let's go back to pro oh no, that's a real bug right there, Apple. So the certificate for iOS 3.2 doesn't work anymore, so you pretty much stuck on a non-usable Fia. Um, the app store works, iTunes store works, but Cydia no go. I mean, it loads, it's actually a real buggy um, thing. Um, but yeah, um, you can install OpenSSH, let's ignore it. Just for the purpose of feed. Oh no, look at that. So this is in landscape. The keyboard and the status bar, but the rest is in portrait. We search a bar and the. Open as it's age, that's fine. Open as it. Oh no, it's written wrong. <sighs> well, never mind, you get a point, right? Um, you've got your iPod application, what you want. Mail works, YouTube doesn't, iTunes, there are almost no apps. I mean, you can technically download a app. I'm gonna pause this video. Okay, so I signed in. Um, let's see, I know a um, mini web browser. Mini web browser. I don't know what it's called again. I think of mini app browser, mini web browser. Mini web browser. Nope. Let me try finding this app. Finally found the name. Mini Browser Pro it's called. It's so slow actually. I mean look at the pixels. Well you can't see it on the video but it looks straight out. Straight out. Oh whoa. It's actually installing. No, fuck no, no way actually. And it's fast. And it doesn't crash. <laughs> Secure connection failed. Yes. No uh, support for SSL. Google, that's. I mean, that is the most universal site. I mean, it can load the normal thing, but awesome work, or. Awesome work. Alright, so you can install apps, I mean, you have to find them through Google, but hey, it's awesome, mini web browser works, I mean, you can test the application out if you want. Again, thank you guys for watching this video, downgrade to useless OS, but it's most of the time it's not, sure. I mean, if you want to use it for music, mail, and basically watching video through a browser, you can do it, and you have a jailbroken machine, hey, no man cares. Thank you guys for watching this video, please comment, rate, and subscribe, see you in the next video, peace.